ako po ay isang OFW teacher dito sa Taiwan at patutuloyin ko kayo sa tirahan ko dito. Tara, pasok! Hello everyone, this is Sir Sikat and normally on Sundays I don't like working or taking videos but I am doing this now because soon ipapack up ko na yung madaming gamit dito sa dorm ko. I live in a dorm here in Matsu Islands and talagang konektado siya dun sa school namin. So literal, when I need to go to work, I just go down. I'm really glad that I can share with you this room kasi isang taon ko din to at mahigit na naging bahay and alam ko na yung personality ko eh kahit pa paano may kita dito sa room na to, kahit na alam ko, eh hindi naman ako magsistay dito ng sobrang tagal. So, most likely, I'll be shipping a lot of these items to my next home, but for now, please enjoy the rest of this video. Outside my room is a shoe rack and some storage. When you come in, you'll see this cabinet. I dedicated this to my dishes and cooking instruments. Nagsastock ako ng tubig kasi ayaw kong lumalabas para lang kumuha ng drinking water. Sa iba ba yung plancha, vacuum, bags, at iba't iba pang mga abubot. Kailangan dito may silica gel ang bawat sulok kung hindi ay aamagin yung mga gamit, lalong lalo yung mga bags. This is my bathroom very quickly. So, this is the sink. Yeah, I have to clean my dishes here kaya meron akong patiktikan ng mga dishes on the side. There's a cute little shower here and it's nice because it's enclosed and it doesn't mix up with the rest of my toilet. Deeper. Pugas ng pwet with the soap. Blow dryer, syempre, when I get ready in the morning, hair is always a non-negotiable na ayuse. I also have this Google Home. Nakakonek siya dun sa isang Google Home. So if I play music in the studio, it plays every. Hindi ko na gagawin aesthetic tong area na to kasi ang hirap na mag-usod dahil sobrang liit. Siguro if there's one thing that I really don't like about this bathroom is patami siyang mold. So... And here's my living area. Itong desk na to, dito ako nag-edit, kumakain, nagpapasko, at nagbabirthday. This is the most celebrated space aside from the bed. Di pa man din ako sumusweldo nun, ang unang purchase ko was a monitor. I'm using an M1 MacBook Pro and an RKH81 keyboard. For my voiceovers, I utilize this Razer Siren Mini Condenser Microphone. Perfect addition dito, itong trusty Mi Silent Mouse ko. I mean, it gets all the work done. At syempre, I keep myself hydrated with this TSO flask na two-way lid. Some posters and plants, this IKEA work chair and desk storage make this space very functional. I repurpose the TV rack to a long bedside table. Andito yung mga room sense ko, ointments, at iba't iba pang mga kaekekan. This home has humidity sensors and lights operated by Google Home. Okay. How's the weather today? Today in Began, Lin Chiang, there'll be thunderstorms with a forecast high of 24 and a low of 23. Right now it's 24 degrees and mostly cloudy. Now, here's where the magic happens. Kimi. <laughs> Just above my bed is a clock. Game changer yan lalo sa madaling araw. I wanted a full-size mirror pero hindi kayang iship dito. So, this worked for me naman. Here naman sa cabinet, sa pinakababa ay may mga dry goods, medicines, and stock ng paubos ng mga Pinoy goods. Except do sa drawer sa pinakataas, everything is dedicated to my clothes. Nagpa-practice ako ng capsule clothing kaya mas onti talaga yung damit ko. While my winter clothes are stored in my luggage to save space here. So, the ones here are on my rotation. Thank you. 
Ito yung parang shelf sa ibabaw ng desk na nandito sa room na ginawa kong patungan ng TV. I also invested in a machine para makatipid ako sa pagbili-bili ng coffee. Hmm, itong oven na to, binili to galing sa government stipend na 9,000 NT which we all get, no? Mga teachers dito sa public schools. Then, the fridge. Frankly, talaga namang mamimiss ko yung space na to na nagbigay ng comfort sa akin. But, I'm happy that... I'll be leaving this room soon. Turn off the light. With all that said, thank you so much, Room 306. I never really got the charm of living in a dorm. More likely, kung nakadikit ito sa school kasi, syempre, talagang mawawala ako ng privacy. And feeling ko kasi, yung bahay ko, yun lang yung talagang lugar kung saan ako pwedeng mas maging komportable. Pero na-appreciate ko din naman siya in the end kasi nga, bababa lang ako, nasa work na ako. Plus, libre dito yung wifi. Yung tubig ko, libre din. And sobrang mura ng kuryente ko kasi meron kaming solar panels dito sa school. I can say maybe I save about 50% of my electricity consumption. Kung may kita nyo naman, very reflective to na naging buhay ko sa Maynila. Meron akong Google Home, may mga ilaw ako, and napaka-importante sa akin ng ilaw kasi talagang this brightens up my mood, most especially in winter. But of course, may kasama tong mga disadvantages. Tulad na lang ng hindi ako makalabas, na parang hindi masyadong maayos kasi may kita ko yung mga kawork ko, or pangalawa, yung pinakaayaw ko, eh, yung ingay ng school. Minsan naririnig ko. Pagka-holiday, kasi yung school bell namin, parang naka-online lang siya. So, kung Monday hanggang Friday, tapos holiday, just ko, narinig ko yung school bell. And meron yatang trompa dito sa tapat ng room ko. So, talagang nagigising ako every 40 minutes. Plus, pagka nagpa-practice yung drum team namin, yung mga drums dito, yung mga Taiwanese drums na malalaki, just ko talagang dumadagong-dong tong kwarto ko. So, yun lang naman. Pero, those things come occasionally naman. And I think the advantages in this case outweigh the disadvantage. But yes, I hope you enjoyed this video and I don't wanna talk more. Siguro naman na-observe nyo na kung ano yung meron dito sa room na to. But if you have questions, I'd gladly answer them in the comment section. If you're planning to move abroad and first time ninyo mag-move out at mag-live alone, go for it. Kayang-kaya nyo yun. Ako nga, eh, nasanay ako na andyan lahat yung convenience sa bahay namin sa Maynila. Kinaya ko and kung siguro mas maganda at mas mangangya pa yung buhay ninyo sa akin, maniwala kayo that you learn the ropes and you're enabled to do many things, diba? So, yun lang. Thank you so much for watching this video and bye-bye.